remind him that the last time he sent the money, it was not enough to buy all the provisions. Oh, sorry, I forgot to tell him. Are you guys talking about money transfer to buy provisions? Yes. yes. But don't you know about Baluo? 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 What is Baluo? Baluo is a service that your son can use to send provisions directly to you guys from the shop. And you don't have to worry about the exchange rate. Tell me how Baluo works. It's very simple. Just log on to baluo.com and shop or download the app on your phone. You can shop on the website or using the app to buy online basic products for your family and friends. With Baluo, you decide what your money is spent on. Your money, your choice. Buy online products for your family and friends in the Gambia, Senegal, Nigeria or Mali. Baluo, better than sending money. of owning your dream homes. EJ Investment is here for you. Secure our quality bungalows with two, three, or four bedrooms or our story building three or four to five bedrooms at very affordable prices with flexible payment plans at our Sanyang Seaview Estate where you can enjoy the cool breeze with modern infrastructure such as the roads, covered drainage system, modern electrification with street lights, gated entrance with security posts, and social amenities such as gas station, shopping mall, medical clinic, park, school, children daycare, and a lot more. Our dedicated team of professionals will keep the estate clean at all times, provide security and patrol team within the estate premises, install latest technologies such as CCTV, Wi-Fi, home network installation, sonar panel, and power backup system. Also, check out for our additional home facilities and interior design service, such as premium tiling, wall plaster, home landscape, fingerprint home lock, and a lot more. Visit our office at Senegambia Kololi Highway and get a free site visit tour or contact us on 4464-838. WhatsApp us on 3259-220. Or you can visit our Facebook page or Instagram on EJ Investments. EJ Investments, we are first in properties. Assalamu alaikum badi ngol ngali konton kale bismillahi ko deke momobe ker fatu jube kam be lorin damen of course walem kanifing police station o de dulami alon ko of course am madi jobate bi fananga bina jenne dulami alon ko abina report la police wol ya jang aliya kala mutal dum commando ya kuma de questionin na kareba police station o da dada jele signa fula ngol bari na ta case ni transfer kanifing police station o do madi ya charge min na walem walem false publication the and broadcasting ya charge wala andu ye case ni sound janne of course am na ta janne pirka jibero ke anin police be mun kule kachala bi anin jumalle bina pour que ma be ni am case to jang anin mune be fola jam bi be dunna am konotole Of course, I'm not doing that. I'm police soldier. I'm not doing that. 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 I'm not Madi was asked to come and report this morning, Monday morning at 8.30, which he did. Um, he has reported inside, and he is informed that he should report back next week, Monday. Um, we're getting a little bit worried. This go and come, go and come. I, I, I think we, we need to decide, we need to do something. That's my take on this. We need to do something. Of course, we cannot discuss that here, but uh, my chairman is around. We would, we, would, we would have to see what next step we would take. Because um, this is the same tactics that has been used during Jamais era. We cannot allow that now. And we've said never again in this country can people be humiliated, can hum people be tortured or killed. Now, if we allow this thing to continue, it will go out of hand. And we, as citizens of this country, we must stand to ensure that this does not happen here. Never again. 
right? We come on Monday and see what happens. But meanwhile, we will discuss as to what the next step is. Thank you. Well, I was not at inside, yeah, yeah, but... They, they, they said um, the, the prosecutor, they've made their opinion and sent it to the IG for consideration. So they, they have to wait for what the IG thinks, you know, their headquarters um, about their opinion. So basically, it's like they are, they are not decided, I mean, which is um, strange. I mean, uh, how could they say they are not still decided? So as Yabo is saying, I think... It's utterly unacceptable that um, uh, we, the sovereign citizens of this country, the people we elect and appoint to manage public office for the purpose of protecting our rights and satisfying our needs to submit our will to ensure we enjoy freedom, security, and justice, would now use the power we gave them to subject us to such harassment. I think it has to stop. This is not North Korea. This is not Ya Jamme regime. We voted out um, Ya Jamme dictator, 1st December 2016, so that we enjoy all the rights that are in our constitution. And so if that is the case, we cannot sit here and people, because you, op you acquire a position called president, or you acquire a position called IGP, or you acquire a position called minister, or national assembly member, or any kind of public office, an office that is our office, to serve us. You want to use that office to now harass us. That is unacceptable. No decent, sober Gambian, no self-respecting Gambian, no patriotic Gambian should accept any public officer, from the president to the last primary school teacher in Boraba, to abuse you. It is not going to happen. And so, Monday, if they don't take an, I mean, I mean we will, as Yago said, we will discuss. But uh, rest assured, this battle is just beginning. You understand? I'm, I'm not a foreigner in this country. I'm not a tenant in this country. You understand? I did not drop from the sky. I'm a bona fide sovereign citizen, like all Gambians. The people who occupy public office, they are my servants. They are there to protect me. All right? They are there to protect every citizen including Haruna Jata, Usman Davo, and Keba Seka. They have a duty to make sure there is justice. If they don't do it, we will tell them. And if we tell them, they need to act on them. And not to come and clamp down on us like, you know, we are sheep and goats, and they are wolves and hyenas. That is not going to happen. So this is the matter. If you come back next Monday, and they ask you to come back another Monday, what are you going to do? As we said, we will discuss that outside this meeting. No justice, no justice, no accountability, no justice, no peace, no justice, no peace, no police brutality, no more, no police brutality, no more, no justice, no peace, no justice, no peace. John, you want to say something? I feel insulted. I feel insulted. I feel abused. Um, my sovereign rights have been damaged in the first place by the IGP for having the audacity to call me to go and answer for my opinion. That is a clear, blatant abuse of power by the IGP, a violation of our constitution. So I feel so insulted that I'm, I'm standing here because of my opinion. It is my opinion that has created the Gambia government. Because when the Gambia government, those we elect, when they come to us, they tell us what they want to do. In our opinion, we think we will vote for you or this one. So that opinion is what created the Gambia government. And it is our opinion that we check them. We hold them accountable. We monitor them. So for us to express that opinion, an opinion that is not promoting hate speech, that is not promoting violence, but an opinion to demand justice and accountability, you call me to ask me why I express that opinion. That is a blatant violation of the Constitution by the IGP, okay. and he will be held to account for that. He will be held to account for that. Well, so my being here is a gross insult to my dignity, to my right as a citizen of this country, that I'm going to fight to the end.
Thank you. Thank you. Um, you want to say something? Okay, let me, um, on behalf of civil society, thank all of us, civil society leaders and every Gambian that is here. Um, I think as everyone has said, um, and as we said on Friday in our statement, enough is enough. We are not taking this any further. Um, no public official is going to step on our rights as Gambians. And uh, we will do everything in our power. And uh, I have said on Friday that we either go into the conference room and discuss or get into the uh, boxing ring and fight. And uh, Gambians are tired. The intimidation um, is uncalled for. I, I, my heart goes out to Madi's uh, relatives, uh, especially his mother, that is concerned. We cannot have our old folks being concerned about us when we leave. On Wednesday, I was at a program I left the program and I delayed a bit in getting home and my mother was worried whether I was picked up or not. We cannot have that. We cannot go back to the Jami days. And this has to stop. It has to stop now. And uh, we are calling on every serious-minded Gambian to rise up to the task. We are not a people that are unlawful. We will follow the law as much as we can. But we can also engage in civil disobedience if it's called for. And we are not afraid to do it, and we will do it if we are pushed to the, to, the, to the corner. So let nobody try our patience. And I speak to the authorities. Nobody should try our patience because we have got it to, we have reached the, the level that uh, you have tried us. Uh, we have allowed these laws to prevail for too long. And we are calling on the National Assembly, uh, our representatives, to ensure that these laws are re repealed. This government campaigned on the promise that they would repeal all the bad laws that Jame put in place. The mere fact that they have left it shows their, that how disingenuous they are and how um, unempathetic they are to the plight and the pain that Gambians have gone through. And we are going to push this to a logical conclusion. Uh, we will not tell you everything that we will do, but we will go back to the drawing board and definitely the public will hear from us. Um, and let me say quickly that we will never be intimidated. And in, in conclusion, let me say this. It is shameful that Madi was one of the, f it is shameful to know that the person that Madi supported, the vice president, Madi was one of the first persons to support the candidacy of the vice president. And the vice president, being a member of civil society, is remaining silent at this time. It is a shame. It is a shame. It is a shame. I, 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 don't have, I don't have a problem with Adam Abaro now. But let me talk to my vice president. The one that is a member or was a member of civil society came from our ranks. The one that we believed would live and epitomize the ideals of civil society. Now she becomes a politician. What does this say about the values? that we as civil society say we espouse. So it is a shame that our vice president coming from us can be silent. But let me also say that it is also disheartening to know, and I have said this, I will say it again, all public officials that when they get into public office things they can become dictators, and when they leave, they slide back into civil society. We are saying that no more. We will shame you, we will disown you, and we will make sure that you don't have space within us because you cannot use us, and we will not allow you to use us. With this, ladies and gentlemen, I thank you. You will hear from us. We are not, we are not going to be intimidated. Thank you will hear from us. Want? What do we want? Justice. What do we want? Justice. When do we want it? Now. What do we want? Justice. What do we want? Justice. When do we want it? Now. When do we want it? Right now. What do we want? Right now. What do we want? Justice. What do we want? Justice. When do we want it? Now. No to police brutality. Say no to police brutality. Say no to police brutality. Never again. Never again. Never again. Never again. What do we want? Justice. What do we want? Justice. Justice.
Inim bare na tan na ko deke of course am bi kareba police station oto again um inim police wala kacha tata nyadela well police wala men fo wolom ko the prosecutor ko itel la miro nin case ta koto itel lo safere yaki ila nyaton ko le ig la office so am nda ko pro wala wala ajibe ko be la la nyame so o kan e ko ngata fo tanan dum tanan nala ngamuru nan ko deke uh, July 13, 9 o'clock, Samanda, so in Salam Munabekala. I come to Yafuni Lenun, Cabrini interview Soronum Commando, Econi Musa, of course, some police station or again, Foni Tate, Aras, but it is on Nakamurum Katari Potina again, but still now a case in Transfaja Nebinakan, Munabekirin, Hanisaikana. Yeah, because a call at Hanyaming, a left of Rala Kunto Laleto, no Kata, of course, Mebalanella sign, a coib investigation. You go and attend. You go even prosecute. So, Janan Daraje is in a lumen Daraje and a somo. You go and attend. Attend first day. You go, you know, the charges confirm. You go about killer. Uh, about jibia sort of. So, Ghana and being salon from bit of court, from bit of court. So, Kumata being Ghana. So, being Ghana, you go have a miro. It is a prosecutor. But the matter case in Yaming at Emu Miro is safe. But I call a miro at the case in Yaming. I only key IG office. So ten and lung in Sina Purin Salon Aji Memfo. So I didn't know. Aji Nyanta Frako Angata court or case ning no case. Nako ngata nako nanan kota ke next day. No, I will not come. Unless if my lawyers advise to come, but I will not come. I'll tell them ni pareta. I have they have my numbers. Alright. My sorties they know them. Ye call after your commodity appear in, in court on this day. That is it. Um, civil society like chairman of the disappointment express kang about the vice president because at that time um it will look on um right now a bit there in there about for can you mean for it is suspect anything like what be la you know problem or coma like a break one day in question and if you suspect anything about that no no my any suspects or don't go vice president back home or attack home i don't know but coming chairman of an army is so disappointing that dr asatu ture me along co uh until now do coke ka musola nyanto kele ka hanabadu la nyanto kele ndani dr asadu touré ka democratie ko kele gambe jang nayo dundi le la jama ngo kele jang e kan fam akan kol la suba nga kol nga nga si nga kol kacha bra wul da ka be do la procéder la ko kan nam ndekata mo floti ka ka la ka endos coming attaquer the coalition candidate so bi nim fada da tembo mento be bi tembo mento Nimo be a menyan tabalan, Tilimbalia, Gambia Jan Kotake, Gambia Dunanian to Tia Kotake, Wenyanda Kala, Doctor Asa to Turinet. Anyanta Lule Raja. So right now, Kona Chamania for Yaming, Doctor Asa to Ture, I mol Jiko Tinale, I mol Betrele, and you know, Debotata Kotor of Terang, because I monkey more the mayor Tandiko, Ate Akamem for Latale. We want a message, Dila, not Rabbe Jibeka right now, Ibe Munefola, not Rena Blandila. Kaitan Dalako, Munata Wulin the Kagamko Trap Lundi, Kanyaton Kaya, Kata Banko Beka, Musola Nyanto Kelendi, Muno Sabu. And for the B at the Hanis Abelodo Silokan, Nakabo Silokan, Nsina Kontiae, Tilimbalian Milbeke and Yim Banko Kang, Kabring Yim Masakunda Sita from Baby Man Katabo Kono, Sadon Vice President. So Mbole Tandila. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Good morning, Mr. Njai. Good morning. You back at the police station again. Uh, it's like Madi will come back uh, again. What did you make of, of all these issues? Thank you so much. The same thing Gambians were crying about when most of these enablers were employed is the same thing we're crying about today. The modus operandi of the very people who enable, entrench, and empowered Gambian, um, Jame, to abrogate the rights of the Gambians are still the very people who are doing the bidding for this administration. So. What we saw here today is nothing new. It's something we're used to, but it's something that is abnormal. It is something that's unusual, and it's something that we must not tolerate as a people. So what we are saying is we do hope that the government will make up their mind and take Madi to court and make sure that he has a day in court to defend himself. If not, Madi may end up staying home until they are ready to call him to a court of law. But right now what's happening tantamounts to harassment. And harassment is causing undue duress to an individual. 
Because imagine Madi living all the way around Pirang, having to wake up by 6 to be here at 8. And when he was here at 8, the prosecuting officer wasn't here. More, more so, the case will not even be heard or he is unsure whether he's going to court or not. So we are not going to tolerate that. And this must come not only to a logical con um, conclusion, but it must stop. Secondly, the politicians campaigned on the promise and pledge that they were all going to do something to repeal the obnoxious and bad seditious laws that Jame put in place to curb our rights. Yes, they have changed the age limit that suited them. They have made other changes that suited them. And now they're keeping some of these things that they think is going to keep on in check. Nothing is going to keep us on check. We are dignified people who have rights that are guaranteed and enshrined in our constitution and we will exercise those rights to the dot and we are going to wait for anyone who is going to infringe on them and we, the people, will do what we need to do to make sure that what our constitution says is what we are going to live by as bona fide citizens of this country. Mr. Njai, what are you smelling about this case? Madi was, he was taken to Kairaba police station, now he heard Kanifin going and come. What do you smell about this case? I'm not smelling anything, but I just want public officials to know that if they feel aggrieved, the laws are not there for people to settle personal scores. The laws are there to make sure that each and every citizen or anyone living in this country goes by the spirit of the very laws that we constitute as a people. So as far as I see, it's all about violation. As, all, as far as I see, it's all about discretion. And we are not going to allow discretion and we are not going to allow violation because we are a country of laws and that's why we booted the dictator out and we are not going to breed we are not going to tolerate and we are not going to allow any other person to make sure that they abrogate the rights of Gambians. If you want to live with us, you live with the spirit of our laws and our constitution. Most welcome. Honorable uh, Nangaref. Jamarek Nangaref. Jamarek. The family is here at the police station. What do you want to talk about? Jerry, I am a Gambian citizen. I am a leader of the party. I have, I might have a son. My son can be also be a victim like Madi. My daughter can be a victim like Madi. Understand? Run for her. My keep. Kung ham na gambian nga onga neka a resident of this country. Tangawar am freedom of expression. Boden ko wala guarantee. So low la nyo pur support. Ne. Freedom of expression, then you can guarantee, and the only way to do it, more you want solidarity to to marry. So, lo lo tahmanyo fitai. The family marry then go arrest. The opinion we have never bulawa. See how arrest be ni jarna konda jaroko. Jaroko, because marry as a Gambian, marry as an activist, the family put express bo pam. So arrest be warrant uko. So they may just dig further. Aras bi lala lala yoka si demokrasi Gambia, lala yoka si freedom of expression of Gambia, lala yoka si unification process bi. Dafuko wanyi, so man dama fong nerek lege lege aji some of these things balang ko def langa whole implication si nga said da am na positive or negative, and this his aras I think has more of negatives than positive. So matahit man mo yote really pur support madi. The first day you because um, the month money on the first day be, it will seem as political. But I'm a guest today, like, lady. I come as a pap, as Papa Njai. Money on lend hand to Madi. Pour one in Madi can be my son, my daughter, my my, my niece, my nephew. Money on your what the same expression you just learn. So low learn because. How many President Baro ne kanang nit ko how many de flat jacket because Papa mo ko yar. Ban advice nga ko just in case you Madi be ne. Um, maluma wah rek. Lead you, lead the president, Barobi, because he's the president. Now separation of powers, la. Um, IGPP more responsible. Um, man, lumare. Okay, man, sun sun police. Deglo, lumare buga, lumare banya dega, rek. Na is from high authority. Na is from above. Man, lo gongo ko. Yo as the police lo lo police lo 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 mama the first day be. The police station be. Nyom as the IGP, he knows the law and he should use his advice to advise ko. Okay, and um, that's why separation of power is important. That's why the independence of the police is so, so important. Why 
kep nga xamné ya ngi public office nga sa rôle sa responsibility dang ko dé jël bu mut té man AGPP la blém mo mo wara géna at set ndax lu arrest bi warant na ko ndax warant ko so you don't want to blame baro for anything baro na ko blém because he's the president but every single person dang am responsibility man i want to blame the AGP nga AGP baro ko wax or not lolu xaw mo ko but what the law says is that the AGP is in charge of peace and security so lo advise baro as a brother um lumo ko advise rek ne let the structures work um let us have a thick skin um let us look at issues when it happens so implement so the action ndax dafa is unification ndax dafa continue is peace peace and security in the country ndax jarna ko madi just express himself an expression bobu taxut ñu am civil war taxu ñu am strike taxu ñu dara dafa express bobu pam and dañu dañ war am tolerance dañ war am thick skin so my advice bobu la wara am rek ne um let's not just um jump sometime to arrest people or call 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 them to what will you are not advising are you going to advise him to drop this case oh, yeah. no 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 i'm going to advise not the president he's not the the this thing. i'm going to advise the the igp to drop the case that that's, that is it igp drops the case whether it comes from baro or not the igp is responsible they should drop the case because i mean luma waxon rek muna nek sama dom muna nek anybody else mu dem express bo pam suñ ko arrêté té ñun defendu ñu ko su ko ko arrêté su arrêté ko ko ma dora jog ni dama defendu ko no no mad is equal to everybody else in the gambia so everybody has the right right to freedom of expression so lola am rek let them drop the case and uh, let us um educate ourselves a little bit more um because through education we know a lot um because suñ educate tu rek um façon ñu ñoy continuer di am uh, ba pare ñu am thick skin we have to have thick skin uh moy lan nga muna deku some um, comments so how let's develop countries yep a lot of people come out and say things that are critical of the government or critical of a situation or even critical of a political party man every every once in a while i get people criticizing me but it's part of the job smoko bugu te get out of the grace so that is it so that is a process that we have to um, ensure and uh, finally to close um ngali yep is education civic education fa ngui jangal ni ni what is the constitution what's our, what's our rights and then um, because dañ ko ro dore from primary school su ko defé ni ñu understand ko and um, the only advi- the other ad- advice i have for the um, uh, security security services is that it's about time we we'll, we we'll look at real reforms of security services what i mean by that going forward the gambia should have a security training college college bi nga xam anybody who intends to become a security officer you go through that college ñu jangala constitution ci ñu jangala um, um, uh, civic education ñu jangala rights ci ñu jangala jangala tolerance so all these things that nga xamne mo re dafa deka mu correct ñu jangal la ko nga xamne so wacce di nga xam sa rights di nga xam naka nga um, uh, 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 p- naka nga police um, uh, and secure the, uh, the, the country thank you very much thank you good morning mr chairman yes good morning first tell us your name uh, my name is john charles nyai why are you here today well i'm here uh, for two reasons one to stand in solidarity with our brother and uh, two to make a statement and uh, let everybody in public office know that enough is enough and we as civil society and as gambians are not going back to the jame days of harassment and intimidation now madi 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 was first taken to kairaba police station now kanifin police station you are the chairman of the civil civil society in the gambia which step are you going to take now in, you know let me state um that civil society doesn't equate to um disobedience and unlawfulness uh civil society has been in the gambia from Jam, um, jawara days we've survived jawara we've survived jame and we will survive baro and we are law abiding citizens and we will do everything legally possible to ensure that justice is done and all we want to see is that there is justice how many people on a day by day basis are making statements and giving their opinions and are not called to the police even a case where somebody was trying to incite violence the police has just turned a blind eye so to now pick up madi because he is very opinionated and he is very uh, vocal is 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 uncalled for you made mention the name of the vice president um on, on your speech 
Did you suspect anything about her on this Madis arrest? No, I, I, it, I'm not. I'm not saying that she is the one that um, is the one behind the arrest. I'm just saying, being somebody that um, Madi, she knows Madi. She's been in civil society, and Madi was one of her first supporters. She should, and if Madi does something illegal, we could all understand. But just to express your opinion, when has expression of opinion become an illegal, become something illegal in this country, especially post Jame era? This is the same government that campaigned that they would get rid of the Jame laws. Why are they keeping them there? It means that they want to use it against the people. And that is what we are fed up with. We are tired with this. So let them tell us exactly what they want, and we would also tell them what we want, because we also have a stake in this country. And honestly, it is enough. This harassment, or this undue harassment of citizens is enough. We are tired. The Gambians are tired. People are fed up. People, when, when Madi is arrested, his, rel his relatives uh, are all stressed up. He has an elderly mother. What, what, what do, do we think about that woman's condition? So it is, it's, it's not fair. It's not fair. And it can happen to any of us. Can you give us some tips of what you will do as a civil society organization? No, well, I have said, I have said this. I will say it again. We are not telling you what we will do, but let me assure every Gambian that we have enough that we could do to cause the system to change. We've been very uh, consultative, but we can also be confrontational, and that's the last thing I want to happen. Are you going to seize funds entering the Gambia? Well, we we can talk to our partners, but the, the the sad thing about that is the Gambian people that will suffer, the masses, and we don't want that. But whatever it's going to take, sometimes we have to suffer for now so that the future will be bright. And whatever it will take, we can talk to our partners, we can put our tools down, we have so many things that we could do. I mean, imagine if every civil society organization in Gambia decides not to implement their activities for one month. Do you know what impact that will make? So let them know. Let will, them that be part, will that be part of your plans? I will not take it out of the table. Thank you very much. All right. Nice to you, um <laughs> Um, it's like um, it is a family in the corner. All the family, you marry and you move away, money can go on. Family, you can go on. Ah, family, I work to back it. The left family, my family, but I'm not a family in the country. I don't marry and you move. I family from the damage. You understand it? Because those friends, you marry from the door, come from all at a murder come on. Family, be more than that door, door man that door come on. Because it is bad in the jail. I be drink coke on. It is a focus. It is a smile. What they can all, I understand. When I'm being on the hard job, bula, I'm not a poor guy. I'm not a mad coma. If I'm feeling the energy, I'm not going to be able to go normal. Because you man, can't pull the cut. I understand. Gambia, I'm telling you, I'm going to go for 22 years. I'm going to go and I'm going to go and I'm going to go. But I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm going to go and I'm going to go. I'm I understand. Ngata ngata mbindi. Wole bi wole nata bontel koto. Bi mota hanya kadi am ni diam dai tayi arasi la korda kono. Ni koko kung i tayi arasi la korda kono. Ntele ngamu bontel bari afa mambang. Hansa be Gambia. I don't say left to justice lela. Malaf no mo again. I tayi mo arasi la korda kono. Oya fa mo i koneta ngun station auto. Left to wole yebo. Um. Ibe mo falam mansa kunda yin case la koto. Ibe mo falam mansa kunda yin case la koto. Ya tra ye feru ta ya kata. Because ning I stop. I done yena. I understand. Ntele mo jali dingo leti. Jalo ni ya ares, mansa buka jalo, jalo mu jalo mu muna ti family dunia kono, jalo ni ntele ngadua jema ngaka mambe tayar, ngata jira dera, bara jalo tingu ni ya ares iko ena si police, yeda la la, ubuka mansa fanga wati, ubuka mansa wati. Jalo jalo buka ares, jalo buka ares, jalo buka ares, ntele jalo ni mansa be dunia lumenta la kama mansa sindi, wata ni mansa jalo ares, ita mo mansa be sila la bang. Jalo ares ubuka mansa wati. Ubuka mansa wati, ada ta wati la, adam baro. Eh, yaya jamii lumi na ajukuna ba ma ajukuna ares ayasema mile tu kabi wana tangu na adam baro la mansa ya bantal jalo boka because jalo jalo ni mansa be si lumi jalo laka wura noma ibidiasi ni la palo kono yangu sana unataka unataka wulenge mangu mke matulari unataka dimayal betulari unataka adam baro noma 
be campagnon kala be wurla noma nga carte o fay kun moy ka fa man sa carte o buka bon ya jamena nga fa non carte o ba bon na sila state house e ko carte o buka man sa bon gambe gambe no yola belief so nga tan gambe no ka carte o ka man sa bon dile nga bondi jang nga 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 bouté ma ko bujo ma ka de sala mol ko adam baro be deri adam baro be deri adam baro buka da ko mina men kala tella mol be wos la ha bar em naka suba sin suba sangi ni rek bro no tuda man my fat jang lam mo la sivité wa luma indi fi ñun ñep xam nañ ko you know dañ jox ma di charges yo xamne you know lo xamne warut nekul lu am nekul dega te ñom xam nañ ne lepp lu ma di wax lu am la way ñom dañ ko jox lo xamne nekul dega ñay understand a charges yo xamne megul ben sens pour silent ñu pour silent ma di ba pare silent ñu suñ ci taxawut dafa jur yenen yu bare 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 lañ ñu suspect ci case bi ni waaw case bi lu len duma wax luma luñ suspect de way lu gën ci ñom mo nek ñom ñu drop ko way even do ñom suñ ko drobé ñun fofu lañu statut ñun suñ xex bi because suñ ko baye noonu mu sédé rek du baax dañ ko def ñeneen ak ñeneen ak ñeneen ak ñeneen that means na ñun ñu do di pack suñ bagage pour dem su ma di bes bu ma di silencer ñun amatuñ dara lu ñoo ñu dañoo pack ñu daw té lolu du fi am nekku ne that's not the gambia we fought for that's not the gambia we want you know i am really disappointed with the vice president mom mi nga xamné won su suñ tankala ne kon di xex pour human right tay muy 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 tanish human right like respect to human right you know amu dara lu mo def ak ñun o amu dara lu mo def ak 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 lu bokka ci human right dafa dafa meti dafa meti way ñu ñu waat monde inshallah dina ñew monde way dina ñew monde dina leen wax ne monde suñ ñewé dañ bëgga dégg ñu wax ñu lo xamne lu leer la luy duga suñ ñopay te ñu jël ñaam ñu jël ñom luñ wara jël ñom suñ paré ak lolu ñun ñu door ñun tamit suñ boss way still now ñun dinañ taxaw ak maadi because we are in this fight together su nekké dañu ray maadi dañ ñoo ray su fekké dañ ko dugal ci kasso bi dañ dañ ma dugal ci kasso because dañ ñoo dugal ñun ci kasso bi because on that day buñ démé protest man ma ng fa won man ma doon wax what advice do you have for the government what advice nga am pour government government bi amalu ma len bet advice because they already failed dañ len dañ dañ failed ñu fail ñu all these political parties nak la sey boole ñom ñep they failed us they failed they failed us failed the government and failed themselves because li 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 nekul luñ don luñ buka nekul luñ 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 soxla you know nekul luñ soxla nekul luñ buka government bi amaluma len ben advice dul nañ continuer ci lom lu bon lu ño def rek ak tapale yek satia yi dañ ko continuer rek way ñun ñun luñ muñta def dinañ ko def luñ luñ paré pour def rek yu bari dañ ko ndoba duñ ko wax ba ñom ñu ngi leena xaar mo de ñu ñew gane yaa investigation ngane ka di dimbalé gay Wow, with the SIS, you are going to see that they are going to be in the middle of Lebanon, they are going to be in the middle of Kuwait, they are going to be in the middle of Kuwait. It's like a story, you can understand. Young people are going to be here every day. You know, every now and then you are going to be here to help them. They are going to be here to help them. They are going to be here to help them. man suma bopa ma ngi len di help SIS why you will never do, suma credit bi duñ ma musa jox credit and i don't need that credit from them why man lena la bugga man i see gambia first i see my people first you know man luma soxla mo nek pour ñu respect ñu suñ ñu respecté rek gambia dina dem man i don't care to work for any government bu tok why su pare su fekké da nga pare liggéey ba pare respect young people li why nekku ne da nga tok ba pare yo you don't respect us ba pare xam nga yo ngay violate suñ human right we have a right to talk We have a right to talk. Nek naka gal ci yeno. Gal ci ñu ngi fa di sona pa ba legui dafa guñ len ben steps. Joxa guñ len dara. Can you imagine we don't have embassy in 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 Kuwait and 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 the like like consulate bu nek am Lebanon mu ngi fena janghay tay su waxe Gambia government li elek mu wax elek mu wax am am janghay li elek mu wax ga ba legui Gambia government munu ñoo dimbele pour help help halay jigen ñu delu ci. ñu bari like ñu bari lañ fa ray i don't want to i don't want to mention mention name because waxuma len ko buguma mention sen name so waxuma ko sen family ci way ñaata nit lañ fa ray nañ dimbele ñu dimbele janghay ñu delu ci nañ dimbele ñu dimbele xale jigenu ñu delu ci ci dikki naari yeb ñu fa di sona ba pare waxuma ñu ne dañu sign mou mou like pour lal pour yobu young people for what i think gambia needs this young people more than more than saudi arabia dubai kuwait or any other Af arabic country because of sen selfish interest ak xaliss buñ leena jox It's really sad the Gambia government. Ni dey fail ba pare and they failed us. I will keep like I will still keep um, I'm, I'm supporting them to investigate and help these people with the SIS. Suñ ko bugge man I don't care. Man ma la nek dimbal fay yuñ ma ci dara joxuñ ma dara and I will not duñ ma jox credit and I don't need their credit but I will do it for my people. Thank I you. think su fekke ne dañoo def dara like so soxle dara te nga gis ko ci fat jañ. You sal fat jañ pour nga soxla am li nga bugga. Man I told them I don't need nothing from you. All the informations they having I give it to them and they are still lazy. They are not doing nothing. fail government 
ala barke ba ke mbadi ngon mo be ker fatu jube kan wolem katchalti mi alon ko nge sotale bi of course am kanifing police station do la mi alon ko bi madi jobate of course anata nun jande pour ka jako ay report ala kesto mi alon ko ya kumandi wala jang of course am bi ate madi jobare ketam multi mi alon ko activist wolem gambe banko kan jang ala kuma kan dol mi alon ka wolle fintindi nun komanto kabring of course am ay diamuta nun black lives matter protest mi alon ko ketam nun komando akam tale ko ya charge wala false publication of an broadcast in your charge wala case ni kuma seta nun damen of course am wolem am kairaba police station ni raka transfer sign kanifing police station oro madi akam tale ko ye lundole diala ko reke sai kay muru nan fo tenen nala ko reke andu madi ko natural loyalia advice natural advice kende ke nam muta nan tenengo akata sonna pour ka muru nan police station oro jang aliye family be mbal fanam moyle mialon ko leddi amuta anin modul ko tangol mialon ko lenata pour ka mabe of course madi la report into mialon ko wala ke ate of course kanifing police station oto jang oto albe ker fatu le jube kan non alnal badi malam te buba gaji ko anen cameraman o mustafa ala barka In communication, connectivity is everything. We ensure that the links never sleep. Quantities and qualities, all in our data service, providing efficient, reliable voice and data service. We believe if you're not up to speed, then you're going backwards. Communications have to flow as fast as the speed of light. Whatever business you're in, having someone who understands your needs is critical. That is why we just don't offer you technology, we offer you solutions. Enjoy Gamsel's internet broadband anytime, anywhere. Your national operator, Gamsel, Yaibarom. ignore_time_segment_in_scoring 56 branches mola soda Gambia ja. Ha? Ka. Gambia kono ani Gambia e bantala bankol. Nko kono ki ya bere. Hm? Kono si fa si fa fo falindiro fo nyaadi lafta mem menna kodi to koto ni kodi maro. Jannam number 1 ni nyonta. An num fana nata anoda enterprise sotale. Wolam wolam nyindi ko domorol fana kol fana be firale de dadi ma ni domorol ni fana be teat. Ha. Gambia dawda yalo ma kum fa kendol sotale ji. Ha e wo moy o diat. Ha. A felen ta. Ni wo ka ni na lafta nyelan kendol e binaji. Yalo e bukani la kol la barka. Ha ha ha. Yalo ndel chosa no lo. Barka.